Hi, it's Ivy. And it's Nina. How are you girls doing today? And for those who don't know us, we created Abante. So Abante is a Filipino word which means moving forward. We created Abante to support women wherever you are in, in your journey to be the best version of yourself. And being in love with the person in the mirror, right? We're it's very important and we're here to cheer to support and to encourage you to move forward and to never give up on yourself i'm very excited for today's topic greg anderson's famous quote focus on the journey not on the destination will be the video's main focus i think i will talk about about it and feel free to share your opinions in the comments right yes so when we set uh, when we set goals we tend to lose focus on the work to do the journey so today's topic we'll talk about how can we focus on that more and how we'll be able to enjoy the journey mm -hmm. and nobody becomes someone without working for it jk rowling did not get published in her first story mm -hmm. uh jeff based basis didn't get a didn't become a millionaire billionaire actually on his first business right and yeah. serena williams did not, uh, did not become an amazing uh, tennis player on his on her first few practices all of these people struggled and pushed through and learned from their journey when you are 100 percent present in their journey it will lead you closer and closer to the goal you're dreaming of true that is so true it is not easy the work to do is not easy it will consist of choices that will make you uncomfortable make you cry make you lose people around you and yeah. that's fine because you're growing and you're doing what you have to do so if it will test you so bad that you'll ask yourself why am i doing this really it will ask you that and if you're stuck in that question try to answer it not on um, like a reason uh, try to answer it with something that is a progress of what you've done so if when you say oh because I want to fit to that size three jeans that I bought try to say like because I feel healthier and more confident than yesterday mm -hmm. if you want to say because I want to gain 1 million followers on TikTok try to answer because every day I inspire somebody with my TikTok so progress over perfection focus on what you've what you've gained from from doing this oh wow i agree on that so much and the more you focus on the present the more you see the beauty of it right you will be less anxious anxious <laughs> less depressed and you will embrace what it is uh instead of what if um each day we are given a life to live so take it step by step day by day it is a gift and no one is guaranteed to live tomorrow wow i agree we don't know what's going to happen tomorrow right um yeah. so also when you keep on imagining tomorrow you miss out on what's happening around you you miss out on today. Mm -hmm. it's actually unrealistic so when you get there you will be more likely to be disappointed Favor the the, mo the moment right at that moment appreciate appreciate what what is going on like right now uh, the goal is to finish and and have a successful video but right now we're gonna focus ivy and i are focusing right now focusing on the journey focusing mm -hmm. on the conversation that we're gonna uh, we're having right now and just appreciating that we're talking right now and we're talking about this and you know sharing this to you and when you are on your journey we want to give you tips on how to value and get the most out of it first we wanted to get uh, to set realistic goals each goal you have you need to have a deadline it's very important i, I believe in that too uh i i read an instagram post that to reach your goal you need to have a deadline or your goal is just a dream the idea of focusing on the journey doesn't mean that you don't have goals but you have to set goals but don't focus on it so much True. I agree. Um, so the second one would be plan your actions. Every day, every time you wake up in the morning, every choices you make from that moment on, it should lead you closer to that goal. So um, whether which food you eat, whether which music you listen to, there's mm -hmm. all of these 
lead you a step closer to your goals. So I want you to have awareness of it. So am I gonna snooze the alarm, right? As what Rob Dial, our favorite podcast, <laughs> the mindset mentor, he always say, never snooze your alarm because that's the first thing that you're gonna do in that moment. And if you, if the first, the first thing you do, you do in the morning, you already fail, you know, you start it really badly. So try not to snooze and to procrastinate. It should lead you a step closer to whatever goals you have, guys. So True, true. And the third is be grateful. Be grateful. Write down the things that you are thankful for, for in the end of the day. What happened on that day that, that made you happy? What happened on that day that uh, you, you felt proud of yourself, write it down. You might not realize it, but what you have right now is what you used to dream of. It changes a lot when you focus on the now and be grateful for it. It's all about perspective, girls. It's all about perspective. And the attitude that you bring on the game gives you the advantage from others. Oh. Okay. Yes. So that's the third one, right? So the fourth one, as I have mentioned earlier, is progress over perfection. We're humans. We make mistakes. So the fourth advice that we can give you is to track your progress. In that way, you can see and look back. Oh, I, I was better before. Oh, I'm mm-hmm. lifting 10 pounds, then eight pounds, two weeks. Right. Yeah, so once you can, you feel proud of yourself, you might be so indulged with the idea of getting there that you didn't even realize how far you've reached. So True. I look True. back and reflect. This is, most, this is really important to enjoy your journey. We have a short life, and the earlier we realize this, the more we take responsibility. Setting a goal might be easy, but staying on the journey isn't. The last thing we advise to you so you can focus more on your journey is to look around you. Look around you. Who surrounds you? This is the now. What can you do for them? And your, if your goals can ex- inspire or teach others, then you will push harder. You will push and enjoy the, you, you'll enjoy the journey more. Like what we're doing now with Abante. We are inspiring you guys. We, we try our best to to study and learn all this stuff so we can teach it to you. And we're enjoying every part of it. Yeah. Right, Ivy? And once you see that your actions have impact on others, you will be more motivated and be more present on the journey. And you'll find yourself uh, enjoying the company of others and learning from them too. Yes, I totally agree. Our goals might feel unreachable. That's why we usually get lost in focusing on it. So we want you guys to shift your perspective and enjoy the now. Um, Leave your opinion um, in the comments below and let us know. Thank you so much for your time today. We appreciate you guys. And I hope you enjoyed the rest of your day. And if you want to make someone stay better, please share this video and like and subscribe for more. Thank you, Ninia. Bye.